Marcus Ortiz joins us live from Papa Murphy Park, where she's meeting the newbies. Hey, you. You know I am giddy right now. You oh, know yeah. this, right? You know how excited <laughs> I am. I've been counting down the days for the season to start. And we are finally here. We've got our first preseason match tomorrow right here at Papa Mercy's Park. You can see the crew. They are getting this ready. Uh, this all beautified. You see they're up on the bleachers getting things done. Of course, the seats over there looking fantastic. So we are hoping you are all join us. I wanted to get everybody rallied up because we have so many new faces. And I'm introducing you to four of them right here. All right, we're going to test my skills right here and see if we can remember names real quickly. All right. We have, of course, we have. <laughs> now I'm going blank, of course. Oh, all right, this uh -oh. is Chris Isley. Chris Isley. Yeah, there you go. You Next got it. You got it. Shannon Gomez and Justin Schmidt. Yes. All right. Tell us uh, again. Tell me where you're from and what position do you play? I'm from Orlando, Florida. I'm number nine. I'm a striker. All right. I'm from Storch, Connecticut. I'm number four, and I play center back. Fantastic. I'm from Trinidad and Tobago. I'm number two, and I play right wing back. Yeah, Fantastic. Irie. I'm from Albuquerque, New Mexico, number five, and I play defender. I love it. Welcome to Sacramento. Uh, you ladies, this is how you start Valentine's Day with these oh, four gentlemen know. here. Yep. And I do believe we have a Valentine's Day uh, cheesy pickup lines. Yes? Yes, yes. Um, are you from Tennessee? Because you're the only 10 I see. Oh! Did you come up with one? I did. Okay. I would have bought you a box of chocolates, but you're sweeter than any Hershey's candy there is. Oh, oh wow. wow. Yes. That'll yes. work. That'll work. That was good stuff. <laughs> All right. We are going to play a little game uh, we like to call lightning round. Random questions, nothing major, okay? You ready? Just first thing that comes to mind, because, you know, we want people to get to know you. All right. This first one. Uh, pro athlete you admire most? Ooh, uh, Roger Federer. I like oh, it. Favorite color? Uh, purple. Favorite cereal? Uh, Reese's Cups, Reese's Puffs, cup. Reese's Puffs. Oh, the Puffs. Oh, okay. Yes. All right. Uh, you're at Starbucks. What's your order? Uh, just black coffee. Oh, that's, that's black. my cup of coffee. All right. <laughs> Next. How about favorite sport other than soccer? Hockey. Your go-to dish if you are making it? Uh, probably, uh, a ribeye with some quinoa and roast oh. vegetables. Fancy. Hello. Okay, you just let me know when. I'll be there. Okay, fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Also, your favorite destination? Uh... I mean, you can't really beat Florida, you know. You know Except not Sacramento. Get or anything, but, yeah. <laughs> no, probably, probably Miami. Miami, yeah. All right. How about uh, who is the greatest greatest athlete of all time in your mind? Of all time. Any sport? Yep. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, yeah, no, probably probably LeBron James. LeBron James. Oh, okay, right. basketball Whoa. fan. All right, thank you so much. <laughs> All right, let's go. Shannon, how about uh, if you could have dinner with any one person, famous or not, who would it be and why? Mom. Love it. Aww. Thank you so much. I like it. <laughs> All right, uh, how about Lady Gaga or Pink? Um, Lady Gaga. Okay. Uh, Bruno Mars or Ed Sheeran? Both. Both. No. Oh. Oh. Do you have uh, a little bit. Ooh, you know I'm going to ask you to show me some dance moves. Uh, probably later on. Ooh, okay. Yeah. All right. And lastly, how about uh, if you could have any magic or superhero power, what would it be? Oh, uh, breathe underwater. Oh, good okay. one. Oh, my God. <laughs> That's a Movie great or one. book? Thoughtful. Uh, books. All right. If you're at the vending machine, what is your choice? Oh. And you know they're not healthy options. <laughs> oh, of course not. Uh, Gardettos. <laughs> oh, salty. And if you were playing soccer, what would you be doing? Uh, playing rugby. Playing rugby. Okay. 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 Not doing a little acapella stint? Uh, no, that, that, that time. Passed. Little known fact, my friends. He used to be in the acapella group at University of Washington. What? So you know what that means. He is a fan of the Pitch Perfect series. Oh, snap. At some point during the season, do you think you could do a little acapella for us? I think that's definitely possible. Yes. He said it on the camera that you know that means it's happening. It's got to happen. So he's going to do a little singing. You're going to do a little dancing. Uh, you have a, a little uh, uh, something that you do before a match. Oh, yeah. No, I, uh, I wet my socks. Do you play with wet socks? Play with wet socks, yeah, that's correct. What? Why? And, uh, and okay, fantastic. All right, gentlemen, happy Valentine's Day to you. I have some Valentine's Day cards for you. All right, I went all out. Help, I'm trapped in a candy factory. <laughs> I love you as much as naps. The other candy hearts are lying, <laughs> and I'm me when I'm with you. <laughs> 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 With you this morning, I wish you the very best. I will be cheering you on. We have a car for you too. Oh, they have one for oh, me! Oh, I love it. Thank you guys so much. It's very special.
signed. <laughs> Sorry, I have about six other cards oh. in my hand. Signed by all the guys. Oh, oh that's yay! awesome. So happy Valentine's Day, and uh, thank you for having us. We, oh, we appreciate it. Oh, I love it. it. Thank you so much. Happy Valentine's Day to you. Don't forget tomorrow's match. Tomorrow, tickets still available. We'll be back after this break.